This is the progress of the house while we are not around. The farmhouse is getting bigger. It's so cute. I mean, this one is looks so cute. Unicorn babies! Let's eat banana. Chicken. We're going to send Rian tomorrow morning to the hospital for admission. Rian have rushes, red rushes, guys. Wow, <laughs> this is so bright. So, good morning, guys. We are here right now at the farm. And we actually arrived here last night. This is the progress of the house while we are not around. Because, as you all know, that the kids are sick the past few weeks i'm gonna show you the progress because the farmhouse is getting bigger and by the way this one these are the bags of sand that we are going to use at our bathroom area i'm going to show you how to transport this bag of sand from the drop off area and these are the 10 bags of cement total of 2000 pesos we put them here at my aunt's house and we are going to transport these to our farmhouse using my cousin horse we have total of 75 bags of sand and we are going to transport these using this horse i paid the horse owner for labor 600 pesos to transport all of these I have two labor and every time they put the bags of sand on the horse, they need to do it at the same time to balance the horse. While the horse have cushion under to avoid him from hurting. This is actually heavy. I felt bad for the horse, but it's more tiring if a human carried all of this. And this horse used to carry heavy loads of coconut and they are used to work at the farm. I hope though the owner gives him treats after work. Imagine how hard it is to carry everything from the drop off area to the farmhouse back and forth. How much more the unseen part of that working carrying the wood from the drop off area to the farmhouse when I'm not around. Mom and dad are working at the farm while I'm at home editing and uploading videos. My videos are free to watch. I hope you guys give time to subscribe to our channel because we work hard on and off cam. Thank you so much. Per ride, the horse carried three bags a total of 25 times going back and forth for 75 bags. This would be easy if Freddy Teddy have off-road tire because he can pass through the rocks just at least 50 meters before the elevated area. But as of now, Reddy Teddy is not strong enough to pass the rocks closer to the house. We need to elevate Reddy Teddy and change his tire. Oops. Wait. This one as well. Then that's the chicken. Um, the chicken, I guess, three weeks. So they're getting bigger, guys. Look. Oh, it missy. Give me your neck. Give me your neck. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I think um, they're about half kilo each. And then earlier at the live stream, we released Tim Tim because there's we have a chicken here that's hatching egg and then soon if she's gonna hatch all of her eggs we're gonna transfer here this one because it's not good to release um newborn or new hatch chickens here because you know it's very rocky the area is very rocky and it's it's gonna be dangerous to like any animals especially ants for small chicks also and this is the progress this is not yet completely clean because um, my parents just built this area a few days ago and then after that they came back to the house and then right now we're going to continue because we are here since the kids are 
doing okay. In the previous video, don't mind the background. <laughs> In the previous video, this area is still have a wall because this area is only our farmhouse. And then a few days ago, they removed this part. Yeah, this part. And then they transferred the tabla here because this is going to be another room very small room and then we're going to put some tabla on the floor and this one in front of me this is our other door this is back door i think it's not back door because it's an in front this one is door as well and then this one is door as well and then right here is door as well next to the toilet and this is our toilet and this is our temporary cover for the toilet and then we are going to work on the toilet tomorrow i guess and then that's also a temporary wall for the toilet and then this one it's so cute i mean this one is looks so cute then we have this door and then we have this cabinet so done and then dad earlier working on this roof for the kitchen and now it's done i'll show you the outside look this one this is what it looks like actually it's not windy anymore here inside actually it's kind of hot another plan that i'm going to do i mean that we are going to do of course wow it's so messy chickens this area this one is going to be cemented but open space open space cemented and then we can sit down here because it's windy and it's in front of this sweet corn and then my next plan for this is i'm not gonna plant a lot of corn i am going to plant sweet corn only and then most of these are vegetables um i like more sweet corn than corn a little in that area yeah a little in that area and then vegetables near the house so that we can easily look at it when there's um predators or something like that you know and this is tim tim so earlier at the live stream i mean tim tim pick my toes because I was trying to get her babies or chicks. Let's not go closer because she's gonna fight you if you go to her chicks. And she got eight chicks. And this one, I have this cement that we are going to use to the bathroom area and the floor area. I am so excited. And then the plan is we are going to celebrate our birthday here my mom and my birthday we are going to celebrate it here at the farm we're not going to celebrate it at the main house because i'll mention the reason why we are going to celebrate here at the farm not at the other house in my birthday in my birthday i will mention that i go get water huh? yes mommy huh? hello guys So we're going to eat some marang.
Rice pa rice. Okay, the bottom is green. This one. So we got this free banana from Father of Ria. Chicken food. Chicken food. Okay, that's it. Okay, so the water is, banana is here, and the water is in this side. Okay, okay, go. We could have gone bang ants, green ants, a red ants, rabagyod. Some banana, go. Eat. Get your shadow, kay ano ba uniform yung mga babies? Uniform babies. Hi. Ginatim, artista ra ba katim? So much baby chicken. So many baby chicken. <laughs> Come here. Oops, don't go closer, ha? Okay, manosik na si Tim Tim. Hi. Hi, baby chicken. Hi, baby chicken. I want to catch it. What? I want to catch it. You want to catch it? No. Tim Tim is going to fight. She doesn't want you to touch her baby. She likes it, da. Yeah, you like it, Dad. I like it too. Now well, let's give this one to Chicken. Oh, this one. Come, go hold the camera, ha. Huh? Hold it, ha. Huh? I'm gonna bring some. Hi, baby Chicken. Ooh. Let's go, go, go. You first. Oops, careful, ha. Huh? Uh, go, go. I uh, will we'll call Tim Tim later. Go, go there, go there. Outside, outside. Careful, huh? Careful. Oh, my gulai. Careful, my darling. Okay. Let's, let's give this one to chicken. Yes, mommy. Hello. Hi. Hi. You vlogging? Hi. Hi. Hi, Leon, to vlog. Hi, Leon. Hi, too. Hi, Mommy. Hi. Hi, Leon. Hi. Hi, Mommy. Hi. You vlogging? Come here, Tim Tim. Come here. Come here. Oh, come, Tim Tim. Alala! <laughs> Alala! <laughs> She's a very protective mama. Oh, give Sophia. Chicken, oh. Nya, ang gagmay. Alala! Di ka saka. Malaway na po na eron. See? No touch chicken, Sophia. Okay. <laughs> there you are. Ay, my go. <laughs> Careful. Okay, it's up here. Slowly. Oh, very good. Oh, so now cook. Let's eat banana. Yay. 
chicken 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 hi guys hi guys hi 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 give look 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 now twinkle Sophia sing. Ja, iblat na ko si chicken. Iblat ni mo si chicken. Wala na si chicken. Iblat ko na si chicken. Hmm, let's open like this. You video them. Go, come closer there. Ito ko ang nako. Show them the chicken eating. Oh, they're eating. Oh, mahunaw sa ako ha. Are you done? <laughs> what is that? No. Uh, uh, what is that? It's long. Slowly. Slowly. Mm, nice chicken. A big, big face. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Where's the chicken? I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Are you hungry? Let's go. I need to eat. And so smelly. Hi, chicken. I'm going to go to the chicken there. Sophia, there's a butterfly there. Color light. Bye bye, butterfly. Uy, kabalo lagi ka mo on, Ana, ay. Hi. Hi, guys. Hi. Dako na ba, siya, pero brown. Let's go to the room. Yeah. Come on. Let's go to the room, guys. Let's go to the room, guys. Let's go to the room, guys. So, Sophia is vlogging. I don't know why. Let's see. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Okay, I'm gonna put it right here. With my camera. Ta-da! Three minutes. Okay, bye. Say bye. Bye. Robot na. No, it's not robot. It's fifty-two percent. I'm gonna turn it off. So good morning, guys. We are here right now at Tubod, and we are going to have check up for Ian here because um, they have rushes, so we decided to send her for check up. Oriana of rushes, red rushes, guys. Sakit? Dili. Dili sakit? Kato lang. Mula aral na siyang kamoy. Dili na siyang tiil kanan. Sophia of rushes right here. Look. And also here. Also this one. Also in her legs. Also here. Yeah, yeah, Ika. So, Sophia had CBC, and then Rihanna as well. So we're waiting for that, and then the result. Guys, we're going to have lunch. And uh, guys, I'm here.
<laughs> Good cause the food. Hello guys, I'm Yayay. Ayay. 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 Sophia, um, her platelet is below the average, so suspected for dengue. Platelet counts for normal is 150 above, and then Sophia is 125. Uh, the doctor suspected um, dengue, but if I am going to test for dengue test, 1,200 pesos for the dengue test. So it's kind of expensive actually. So I am just doing CBC, which is their blood and Sophia's repeat CBC will be Thursday the doctor gave this one to us and then she can do repeat CBC and then for Rian actually the risky part is Rian because Rian platelet counts result is 81 which is below 100 if you're below 100 platelet you need to be um, admitted to the hospital actually guys because the normal is 150 and her platelet is 81 which is 150 if that's below 100 you have to go to um, hospital because you know dengue is more like liquid and Rian is not drinking much water if she will be admitted to the hospital she will need a lot of dextrose guys if we are not going to admit Rayan today to the hospital we need to come back here tomorrow morning for her CB repeat CBC again so which is if we don't admit Rayan to the hospital we need to repeat CBC every day for her monitoring I have referral already from the doctor that Rhea needs to be admitted and then we also need to ask he her dad about this if she's in the hospital they can monitor her CBC like every day to see if it's growing because you need to reach 150 above for platelet counts what surprise she likes to open any um things that we bought wow it's for me yes that's yes. for you it's for you thank you you're welcome wow. sophia really oh, say thank you mine. every time i gave her something i think this is for mommy that it's one coloring Wow, what is this one? You can color it. You can color. What is this one? Kakim. Kakim? No, that's I think tiger or lion. No, that's lion. That's lion. Wait, long sorry, po kabli. Ah, na. Hmm. Wow, you have color pencils like me. Take a take a look, guys. Siki, go. Ano iman ano ano na ano? Anak, yeah, nah. Yay! You like it? Yes. Oh, you're welcome. Now say thank you, mommy. Thank you, mommy. You're welcome, baby. Okay, so I bought also 
sweet potato. And then I'm going to make this one as french fries. Ta -da! And then I bought some apple for the kids. Then I bought also banana, which is this one slowly ripen. From this one, they're gonna eat one banana a day or two banana a day. And then the rest, it's gonna ripe in the next day, which is good. Hopefully you both feel better now soon. We're going to send Rian tomorrow morning to the hospital for admission. Oh, that's not a chair. That's a garbage bag. Yeah, I'm gonna draw here. Where are you gonna draw? Go, go, dito ko. Kwa chair ko. So, we just got back here, guys. This is the third time of Rian for testing her blood. Yesterday, it was unfortunately low in platelets. So, we were thinking of bringing Rian to the hospital. But I decided to have her check again today if we need to send her to the hospital. Luckily, we are so lucky today. Her platelets was growing yesterday it was 81 platelet counts and today is 130 and so she doesn't need to be hospitalized but once the the result for today is uh, 100 below so we have to send her immediately to the hospital but i'm glad we don't need to and then we are just gonna have some papaya um, drink a lot of water for her my mom and her dad actually did some herbal something herbal medicine so let's see if that works because the doctor didn't give us um antibiotic because he said that dengue fever is not um, needed antibiotic. It needs a lot of water. That's why if you're hospitalized, they will give you a lot of dextrous water going through your body. Uh, I'm glad we don't need to send Rian to the hospital. And this one, the doctor gave us um, another test. Her next schedule to check her CBC again is Sunday. And then Sophia is the this Thursday. So actually, Sophia was been um, going to the hospital four times this month. And then Rian going to the hospital three times. Because um, the first day of Sophia, the concern was vomiting. So I sent her for a checkup. Yeah, yeah, Erika. Stop crying. And then the second for Sophia is diarrhea. So I sent her for a checkup again. The first week is vomiting. The next week is diarrhea. The next, the third week is um, fever and then she have fever and then the fourth week but she doesn't have fever anymore it's just rashes from suspected dengue by the way guys and we didn't confirm it was dengue because the doctor asked me if I wanted to test Sophia for 1,200 pesos for dengue test and so I decided not because it doesn't need to because her platelet is down but her other um, test results like white blood cells, red blood cells, hemoglobin, hem hematocrit, and everything else is here is normal. It's just her platelets is um, down to normal average. I'm going to send Sophia next Thursday and that's her fifth, uh, that's her fifth time, fifth time going check up. Um, that would be Thursday. I am glad everything is okay. And then I have to give all of the kids um, electrolyte drinks so that they will drink a lot of water. They need a lot of water because they have um, suspected dengue. If they both hospitalize, of course, the doctor will diagnose because they will test dengue test to the kids. But... Um, for check up, you have to pay 1,200 pesos. <sighs> it's a relief, guys. So we don't need to um, go to the hospital. That's a very, very good news. <laughs> if you guys enjoy, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to click the notification bell to keep you updated. And thank you so much for the continued support. Bye, everyone. <laughs>